Omar uh, Morales is uh, going to meet Jonathan Pierce, and uh, this to me sounds like very much hard uh, match uh, for a prediction. <clears throat> Considering Omar Morales is 11-1, but he had some kind of a odd competition, at least 5 foot 11, 74 inches is his reach. He was born in Caracas, Venezuela, but he is fighting out of Florida at Hard Knocks 365, training with strong guys. He lost to Giga Chikadze via anonymous decision, but he outwork Shane Young, Gabriel Benitez, Dong Yun Na, knocked out Harvey Park. Very durable fighter and very technical. Excellent striker. And also very, very powerful guy. I mean, also against Stefan Wurman. That result uh, was overturned due to punch to the back of the head. But, you know, Conway lost to Giga Chikadze. This shows that he is a very much well-rounded fighter. Now he's going to meet Jonathan Pierce. Jonathan Pierce, 10 for OGSP, 6 foot tall, 71.5 inches is his reach. Interestingly, Morales has 2.5 inches uh, reach advantage fight ready MMA fighter. He lost to Joe Luzon via ground and pound. Now, this was a surprise to me. I didn't expect him to lose to Joe Luzon via ground and pound. I expected via submission, but this guy at Dana White Contender Series knocked out Jacob Rosales. Then uh, out, uh, then stopped Kai Kamaka via ground and pound, which was also another massive surprise. At Bellator, he defeated Damir uh, Ferhat Begovic and Damar Johnson. But I don't think these guys were UFC caliber. Now to analyze, when it comes to tactical aspect of the game, Morales is way better and he has uh, way more experience. Plus, I believe uh, stamina is going to go in the favor of Morales because I've seen Pierce slowing down in uh, that fight against Jacob Rosales a bit. He was slowing down in uh, round three, but... That cross was spectacular, but I've seen him slowing down. Kind of think Omar Morales is a more well-rounded fighter, but I'm not super confident that he's gonna win, actually. I'm like so-so on that, but... Either way, I'm gonna go with Omar Morales, but I'm not confident about this fight. Pierce should be a better wrestler, and he has some good other aspects of the game, and uh, if the fight goes the distance, that's probably gonna be a win for Morales, but... I am leaning Morales, but very slightly.